Thank you, Deputy Speaker. Well, if there's one thing to get people's blood boiling in the Batemans Bay and Maruya area, just mention the word hospital. Let me start by saying we love our nurses, our doctors, and all our health hospital and health workers. They are absolute champions working in the most difficult conditions. But people in Batemans Bay and Maruya just want to have their hospital services improved. At present, around two thirds of patients have to travel outside of the area for hospital and cancer care treatment. That often means a long trip to Canberra. The existing Batemans Bay Hospital is a level two hospital. The Maruya Hospital is a level three hospital. The plan was for a brand new Yurubadala Hospital to provide the higher level four services and include intensive care and mental health um, beds. An announcement was made by the state member and the New South Wales government, and everyone thought we would finally be getting the hospital services that was promised. But no, it's turned out to be another flashy announcement, where the government is good on announcement and poor on delivery. Let's take a look at what constituents are telling me what this will mean for the new Yurubadala Hospital. No intensive care unit, less emergency beds, no acute mental health services, no dedicated paediatric and neonatal support, no orthopaedics. I was contacted recently by a GP aghast that the state government tried to rip out the high dependency monitors from Batemans Bay Hospital. They still want the monitors gone before the end of the year. So locals are at the state where they have no new Yurubadala hospital at all. The new hospital when it's built will have less services but in the meantime, the government is axing services from Batemans Bay Hospital. Constituents tell me the state government is also axing security and staffing at Batemans Bay Hospital. So it's left people asking what in blazes is going on? And where is the state member and the state government missing in action? During the 2019 federal election, the Morrison government promised a radiation therapy treatment centre for the Eurobadella. So cancer patients could have treatment close to home. But the Morrison government has reneged on that too. Good on announcement, poor on delivery. I stand with my constituents in the Batemans Bay and Maria areas calling on the government at both state and federal level to deliver the hospital services that people so desperately need.